Done. Let's come straight to the domestic scene. We'll be starting from Lagos State, where the big news, yes, when you give um, as a mark of impacting people, people will definitely go out there to say you've done well. The FA chairman in Lagos State, Alaji Lamid Kafal, has done it again this time around. He has given scholarship uh, to 36 coaches to go straight to the NIS to equip and impact themselves into the new S techniques when it comes to coaching. Uh, for you, Joel, I, I, when I saw this, I was like, this is one of the best things to happen to football. I think it's the first time we are having such um, a remarkable event in Lagos. Yes. And um, I, I, I'm not surprised what Alaji Gafari can do. This man is simply a magician when it comes to football. He's been fighting a long time to be at the end of affairs in football because he has a lot to give. And he's eventually there. He's there. He, this is somebody that supports grassroots football. And you know what? He's a visionary uh, leader. If you, if you check what he has done with... 36 lion mm. and what he has done with so many other players you find out that he, he's somebody who looks into the future exactly that's what we're talking about and now, now let me surprise you and Laji Gafari is not just scouting for players and give them a life taking them abroad he's giving a lot of african players he was in guinea he was in mali to even do scouting mm. and a lot of the players are even getting contract abroad so this man is not just getting this international award he is somebody we expect to be in the nff now, yes, he's already in the NFF as yeah. the FA chairman. I want him to sit in the NFF, not just Lagos FA, in right. the NFF. He will get there because we, we, we need people like him, exactly. the round peg in the round hole. Exactly. Now, for this particular um, monumental um, project he has them back to fall. What do you think, what message do you think is sending out to the public generally? I like it, Gafari is sending a big signal, not just to the public now, to other FA chairmen in Nigeria. This is time to take back football. This is time to bring football from the grassroots and put it back to exactly where it's supposed to be. Mm. Because this is this is the nucleus of football in Nigeria. Yes, grassroots. grassroots. And now, a lot of people tell you, um, show me your coach and I'll tell you where exactly. A lot of people believe a lot of these young coaches they don't have what it takes. Mm. But all this, every single professional started, player started somewhere. Exactly. We saw pictures of Victor Moses and his grassroots coach. Yeah. So if we give the grassroots coach proper education in terms of football, they will develop good players for the, I mean, to, to make Nigeria proud tomorrow. I'm going to come back to you, but there's something um, that I need to read out to our viewers here. It says, this project, this is a blood tonic for grassroots football development. Mm. It is far from CSRO, Corporate Social Responsibility. It's a football business strategic plan. It's all about making sure football mm. business keep thriving in Lagos. Mm. The more certified coaches we have, the better our boys and girls will develop properly. And in return, we shall have abundant quality players from the youth level to the top level. It didn't end there. Yeah. It's all about encouraging my fellow coaches once a teacher is the good once the teacher is the good student that will not struggle, I'm a coach. This is my Lagos. This is the message to all coaches right here in Lagos. Top notch. Simply fantastic. Professional. Now, let me underline the word here to my fellow coaches. Yes. You need to say Alaji Kafari when he's talking to players. He never went to any UEFA coaching and all that. But he has an integrity. He knows exactly what the player wants and exactly, exactly what he's giving to them. Exactly. This is a little bit, you know, you know, move from Alaji Very loud. Very just, loud. We just wish... Other FA can do this because it has to be a collective effort. My own other concern again is this: apart from the FA doing this, I hope some other corporate bodies can also support what they're doing. And I'm very sure I like the I like the fact that no, no for continuity. This is the first one. Yeah, it has the power. It has the it, it has the image to bring in corporate bodies, which I believe probably in the second edition, mm -hmm. a lot of people might just came into this. Once again, very big thank you for taking on this giant stride, giving the coaches a limb light to actually develop and give themselves the need. To have new skills in coaching these young ones to make them greater into the future thank you for doing this and god bless you from us here super screen want to acknowledge you for what you've done thank you so very much